I am Yurgita Dronina, and I'm a principal dancer with the National Ballet of Canada. I was born in Russia to Russian parents, and I was raised in Lithuania. My mom took me to a ballet performance when I was around nine, and we were thinking to enroll to ballet school. I don't particularly recall seeing a tutu and want to be a ballerina. I was really engaged emotionally, and so that really made me understand that I want to do ballet. Just by being 10 and making a, a decision that this is what I want to do and this will be my life. It's just a total, total striving, dedication and going one direction. At the beginning, I was driven by passion, and passion and dedication and a love to, to what I do. When I went on stage, then it really kind of hit me that, wow, this is the world I want to be living in. Sometimes I do my own class. I concentrate of, on all the problems or weaknesses that I've got for upcoming repertoire, and I work on them. I just always try to be, maintain healthy my body, keep it healthy and strong. That's my priority. Then I can dance any repertoire that is ahead of me. So this is really a daily routine. It's almost like a meditation to me. I just, I put my headsets on and I start very slowly feeling every muscle working and the legs and the arms and the back until I finish the class and I feel myself. I've sweated, I've prepared and I'm ready to dance. I approach my preparation to the performance from really, really basics. When I feel comfortable with the steps and, I, and the steps become one with me and I don't think about them anymore and they become the emotion that I want to express through hands, through feet, then I work on a roll because then I don't think about the steps. It's all performance. It's, it's being a character. I live in a world that I am. This is my world on stage. And this is where I live. In order to make it real, it has to feel real. So it's an emotional journey of the time and the moment. I am always a character I am on stage. And when a curtain closes, it always takes a few moments to just go back and realize that, oh, I lived another life. I lived another story, whether it's Romeo and Juliet or other story. I even died on stage and I cried and I screamed. It just, I love that part. I, I, I truly love living on stage. The life is the biggest inspiration for me to dance. When I live my life to its fullest, I live my roles on stage to its fullest and to grow as an artist, to grow as a, as a person in a real life as well. It's all connected. The right balance for me, it took time to find. And I think I found it. <laughs>